Hey, Kev. Yeah. Check this out. I'm checking. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Let's do it. Do, 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 do. We all know who that is. This is a podcast, the fucking He Man podcast. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. And that's a dope little tune going there. It's fucking Ripper. Who made that? Tails. I did. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I couldn't do that. You make shit. Yeah, I know. Nah, that's right. dope. Yeah. Tails is Ripper. We're not going to get flagged for this, are we? No. Nah. Good. Because it's Ripper. Did, did he do that on a keyboard? I think or so. a program. I think he did it on his phone. Fuck, he's Ripper. And we've got a name for the podcast too. No, no don't believe you. Yep. Is it on the internet? It's going to be. Well, put it on <laughs> and I'll believe you. This is where well, it's called Podcast of Grayskull. Very good name, Ed. By the Podcast of Grayskull. We have the power, Gav. We are GD. And this is episode two. Yeah. And now we have a proper name. There were some some good suggestions in the in the comments yeah. of the last one, but yeah, that while I was just sitting right there, it's like I don't know how I missed it in the first place. But yeah, I know I sent that to him once ages ago. Did you? Yeah, so you probably mentioned it when we were first thinking up names. But... Yeah, before you even thought of the podcast, I yeah. came up with the name. You know? Did you? Fuck yeah, that's good. That's how fucking ripper I am. I said this episode we're going to be watching the disappearing act. Yep, and. Or the disappearing act. And She Demon of Thantos. Thantos. Yeah, oh, oh, yeah, that's a good episode, actually. Thantos. Keeps your minty fresh. Good do. Keeps your He-Man fucking fresh. Does. Does. So get your... Um, Things up, yeah. open. And the, um, the Diamond Rave disappearance, because we're doing it in order of production order from He-Man.org. Yeah. That's what we're so we're doing. doing episode three and five. Yeah. But number four was the Diamond Rave disappearance. Yeah. That we did in the pilot. Yeah, I remember doing that. That was quite fun. It was fucking a ripper. Now we're gonna do. We got the the notes from last pod. We're gonna mm-hmm. do a spotlight on Man at Arms, and we're gonna do a trivia. Which one do you want to do first? Um, hang on. I've just got to really concentrate on this. <laughs> All right, we'll do Man at Arms first. I could hear you concentrating then. Oh, he's still concentrating. Concentrated out in the ass. Fuck yeah. Alright, so... Go on. Fucking... Man at Arms. Also known Warwick as Duncan. Arms. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Duncan. Oh, D- Duncan for... White. <laughs> oh, fuck off. Fucking your thinking stinks. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, right. <laughs> Duncan, what's Duncan's last name? It doesn't say. Do you know it? No. Does it ever say? Probably. But before, we got the Wikipedia thing that says some shit about him, but what are your thoughts on him? Um, very clever. I know what you think of him, but very clever when he comes to creating all the, like, shit. You know, he comes up with freeze rays and fucking all the mobiles they get around on and shit. He's yeah, very he's clever. Like, he's more of an armourer than a, than a man at arms. Yeah, the leader of the guards. Isn't Teela the captain of the guards? No. She is. Is she? I reckon. I don't think so. I bet she is. But well, we'll, that answer will be question. It will be answered. Well, we'll, we'll do Teela next episode. Yeah. All right. For the spot. One of us is right. One of us is wrong. And I'll be wrong because I'm always wrong. <laughs> it We've doesn't got... matter. Oh, I'll remember. I'll write it down later. But oh no, you'll forget. Okay, but I have to listen to this when I. Oh yeah, all right. Again, when I put it up, but. So you'll so, remember then. Yep. Duncan. So what? Yep, There's Duncan. The. Toy doesn't have the Starker. No, the original toy does not have the, the uh, Cookie Duster. But they put that in. It says I already read the, the thing. Yeah, good. But it says they added that into the cartoon. What the Cookie Duster? To make him look older. Ah. Oh. To add into the story because he's Teal's dad. Yeah, you can hardly see the dude's boat race anyway on the first mm. figure. Is a big mask fucking hanging over it. He's got that big face plate coming off his chest armour yeah which isn't like as big that. in the cartoon is it no but it comes up automatically or is that just in the new one that's in the new one I think where oh. his arm is a bit more yeah crazy. just fucking <laughs> up it comes so you want to have a and yeah oh no you got something I, else I was got a, I've got a question but mm-hmm. I know the answer alright ask it then and see if I know of course you know what but who is Okay, so 
Duncan Man at Arms sees Taylor's old man. Mm. Who's he, who's her mum? Would you want to spoil that or wait for the? That's why I was zooming and ahhing. Yeah. Don't leave it. Yeah, it says it in here. I know it says it in there, but, but let's just... actually, he's not her biological dad. He is in the original cartoons. Not according to this. Really? It says Taylor's foster father. Well, then who's the real old man? I don't know. Unless it's one of the gods or something. Well, that's probably why Taylor's so tough. Yeah. But oh he... well, I didn't know that. I. Was... But we'll uh, find out when we get to the episode. That yeah, because there's an episode where she wants to find her mum and shit. So in, this is from the Wikipedia. Yeah. And it says, In Filmation's animated series, Man at Arms, given the real name of Duncan, despite being a soldier and master of weapons, is primarily peaceful and prefers alternatives to fighting. Though his stature suggests a warrior, his character is primarily patterned after skilled mechanics and he likes to pass the time working on all the kingdom's vehicles. He's also Teela's foster father. Oh. As well as mentor to Prince Adam. Yes. And then there's the thing, the spoiler about Teela. Yeah, we'll skip that part. And... Does now, it say who the real old man is? No. But Man at Arms wears armour which is slightly different from that of the standard uniform of the Royal Guards. Why? Because he's shit. No, because he's probably higher rank. So yeah, so different... everyone should have the same. That's fucking... That's not fair. So the fucking little blokes... Copper hiding and fucking man at arms sits there loving it. Well, it doesn't mean it's better, it just means it's different so you can tell who he is. Yeah, so if, oh, a, okay. if a soldier comes from another garrison, they know that he's an officer. Oh, okay. But yeah, And it well. might be better because they want the, the good ones to stay alive for a bit longer than the, Shit the new guys, yeah. Yeah. Man, uh, there's, I'll start again. Man at arms wears armor, which is slightly different from that of standard uniform of the Royal Guards. His mustache mm-hmm. was not present on the original figure. No. Having been added by filmation to make him look older and wiser and more fatherly. Oh. Although original prototype sketches of Man at arms figure gave him a goatee beard. Oh. Did you know that? Yeah, because that was in that big book. Was that? Yeah. They might have made him look like evil Spock or something, but. Yeah. The goatee's kind of like. Evil guys in yeah, they cartoons do, don't and they? shit. Yeah. Now he's often pestered by court jester Orko. Orko's magic tricks often backfired directly at him. Yeah, cops eggs We've and seen shit. That. Yeah, he yeah. gets fucking eggs and shit on him. Duncan is also one of the three people that knows who he man is. That's so. right. There you go. Yeah, so I what do you re- what, what do I reckon? What? You what know about what? The, the, the toy? No, you, 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 you say what you were going to say. I was going to say, I've always thought to myself, if you ever get another fucking... Um, man at arms in the originals I drew a fucking stashio on it and stand him up there with the rest of them yeah that'd be cool this was something to do but what do you reckon as a toy is he a ripper toy um in the original yeah um yeah I like him when he's complete with the he's got like you say the fucking chest plate and the is your one complete it looks complete yeah I've got mine's complete and it's got the um arm things and shit on him Mm -hmm. yeah that's complete yeah what um, weapon I, does he come with? Doesn't he have a club or something? Yeah, like a... Yeah, something like that. But I got him from um, the market for two bucks. Fucking bargain. As is. and But he also has... See those shit on his arms and that? Mm. The spiky things. They're the same ones as um, Beastman's. Ah. In the original figures. Can you see Beastman up there? Yeah. Yeah, so he's got the same ones. The, the shoulder yeah um, armour yeah that's sweet so but we said yeah. like like last time they, they reuse heaps of shit yeah oh fucking if they do it's spot on there but yeah no I like it as a figure the original yeah I was wrapped picking it up and did you have it when you were a kid no did you ever see one when you were a kid well, I can't remember yeah, probably you, not did your mates have one well, maybe didn't but, have mates ah uh, yeah that's true but then the man at arms in the 2000 X figure looks fucking dope as. He's got a mass club. A big fucking oh, shoulder yeah, plate. Yeah, his arm is heaps bigger, isn't it? Yeah, he looks tough in that. Like, real tough. And yeah. then the. What are those ones called? The, the si- classics. Yeah, the classics. That one looks tough too. Yeah, he looks cool. He's very similar to the first one, but just fucking. Just more detailed and Yeah, yeah just fucking toughed up a bit and shit, you know? But also. 
man at arms, like you're saying, he prefers not to fight or whatever, or find alternatives to fighting. Mm. But he's fucking as ripped as he man is. But they've all got the same body. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. So yeah, he should be fucking kicking ass. But yeah, look, I don't mind man at arms. I guess he's not Duncan. Yeah, yeah, I'm Duncan. What are your thoughts on Duncan? Be honest, Ed. But the, they're the toys, Rad. Yeah. I can't remember ever seeing one as a kid. Just on the back of the box or a commercial yeah. or whatever. I'm hoping, wishing you had it, though, no doubt, probably. But I, I used to like him as a kid. But it wasn't until re-watching them, the cartoons as an adult that I realised how fucking shit he was in battle. <laughs> Here it comes. Yeah, well, you, saw, you saw what happened. Yeah, I saw it, yeah. All right. But we'll watch, I bet in, uh, like, he'll do some rad shit. He's eventually got to do something cool. Yeah, he disappears and shit like that. Gets disappeared. Well, that's not that cool. <laughs> it is, he gets disappeared. That'd be cool if you got disappeared. That'd be fucking good if you did. No, I'm not disappearing, but if you disappeared, as long as you left your wallet behind, I'd be rad. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's do the trivia. All right. Oh, it's gone away. A shit cunt. So we're going to do a He-Man Classic Series. Now, this is very difficult, this one. Oh, God. And this was put up in, looks like 2002. That's a little while back. But it's had um, over 3,000 people play it, so. Oh, can't be too shit. Let's have a good look at this one. All right, He-Man quiz. Can't be worse than us. Play quiz game format. You ready? Yeah. Let's go on, it's loading. He Man and the Master Universe quiz. I was ready before it loaded. It was one of the best cartoons of the 80s. Test your knowledge and see how much you know about the classic series. Alright, they fire away, Eddie. Let's go. Question one What was the name of the first episode of He Man, Diamond Ray of Disappearance, Dragon Invasion, Cosmic Comet, or The Curse of Spell Tone? Hey. The Diamond Ray? Yeah. Yeah, fuck yeah. Only because we just did it. No, but it is. It's True or false, Battle Cat did not speak in the first few episodes. False. False. No, it's true. See, I ask, remember I was asking if he talked? Yeah, Because he wasn't right. talking in the first ones. Right, which evil warrior captured Teela in the episode Teela's Quest? Yeah. We've got Beastman, Evil in Triclops, or Merman? Beastman. Beastman? No. Shit. Evil in? Yeah. No. Merman. It was Merman, yeah. Merman's tough. In the episode Disappearing Act, which we're about to see, where did Adam's sword go when Orko accidentally made it disappear? Uh, Attorneys past Snake Mountain, the planet Omaris, the Timeless Dimension. Timeless Dimension. No. Omaris. No, fuck. Shit. Orko had to go to the past to retrieve the sword, which we're going to find out. Yeah. And which planet was Count... Marzo's flower farm referred to in the episode The Eternia Flower Aronia, Troller Eternia or Draenos A Aronia, Troller's where Orko's from isn't it? Probably No B Um no D It was Troller was where I think it was from Orko Yeah Which evil warrior did Manny faces impersonate in the Shadow of Skeletor. Merman, Whiplash, Beastman, or Skeletor? Beastman or Whiplash? Skeletor. No. It's got to be Beastman or Whiplash. Oh, Beastman. Yeah, I was right. You were. It's on the net. In the episode, The Problem with Power, mm. Skeletor tricks He-Man into thinking he's accidentally killed a man. But yep. in fact, the dead man wasn't real. He was just a holographic image conjured by Skeletor. Skeletor the yep. man was dead already Skeletor just made it quite came and killed him yep. the man wasn't dead at all he was paid by Skeletor to pretend he was dead the dead man was really General Tataron of the Goblin Army in disguise shit that's the last episode is it? Mm. well what's the answer? what was the question? Uh, it's going to run out of time in the episode the problem with power Skeletor yeah, yeah I know but yeah he, he, into killing a guy but what happened? he, he, he gives up the power he gets rid of the sword and doesn't General want to be General Tatterman had no heartbeat. It was the, the Goblin dude. In which He-Man episode was the name 
was named after and based on an episode of Star Trek Attack from Below the energy based the remedy or the arena well, fuck if I know that it's gonna be the energy based or the arena what do you reckon oh fuck you need to answer that one not the energy based uh, it was the arena fucking oh. that was just a guess but what planet is Adam's mother from Earth yeah in the episode Orko's new friend the title character Squunge the trollin had a very bad habit what was this taking dangerous risks cracking jokes in serious situations compulsive lying or smoking compulsive lying yeah oh shit in which episode can Evil Inn be seen without a helmet fuck I don't know Eternal Darkness Witch and the Warrior Demo the Demon or Dylan of Darklands oh, I don't know That's Witch just... and the Warrior yeah. yeah good guess cause she's a witch yep in the episode here there are skeletons everywhere which two evil warriors were seen standing around waiting to be re- replicated by the uh, multiplying machine too bad a modular Cobra Khan and Webster Beastman Trapjaw Spike or Clawful it's either going to be Beastman yeah it is so... not Spike or Clawful yeah not fuck Modulock. oh mod- that's a trick question because he's a Shiro character yeah Poor. fuck in the episode The Time Corridor an obscure one shot villain was seen working for Skelter what was his name Jawbreaker Dragon Man Claw Man Fang Man Fang Man Fang Man I think it's Dragon Man Fang Man yeah ah oh, you got it Ripper <laughs> see Count Marzo captured the son of which heroic warrior Mechanic, Fisto, Stratos, or Manny Faces? Stratos? Uh, no. Manny Faces? No. It was. Hey. Mechanic. True or false, Man at Arms is not Teal's real father. True. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's true. See, I told you. Yeah, you're right. Adopted father, her real mother, yada, yada, yada. Uh, her real father's identity is unknown. All we know about him is he was apparently a great warrior who once fought to defend Eternia. That's that fucking... You know that other guy? Yeah. Hey, yo. Score, 68. We got 68. That's pretty rare. It's a pass. Oh, no, that was... Wait, wait, wait. He scored 6 out of 15. That's shit. No, that's the average score. So I can't fucking figure out how to read the, the the scoring on these fucking things. Charles, stop, right, right, so. Well, we got 505 out of 1,500 That's points. Shit. Oh, no, wait. We got 84 trivia points, but... It's fucking... It's dumb. I don't know how to... We won. Just say we won. Well, I think we got around the average. Better than average. Yeah. My fang man fucking got us over it. That was a good pull because I thought I was going to... Dragon Man's another character. Though, yeah. Wasn't he? But, but you know how I knew that? Why? Because I was looking at him on, a, um, on eBay for sale. Is he in the classics? Yeah. That's cool, the classics they do. Like, they're one-off characters and that... that mm bunny dude we, we always talk about Plundor yeah it's cool I yeah like Plundor him. yeah that's I a just, Paul Dini episode too where he's mm, from I just can't afford to buy them they're like 50 bucks each mm. but, tell them how you got like half of your set they were half of your collection oh fucking yeah there was a um, there was a shop so I fucking robbed the cunt mm and yeah they had heaps of them so I just stole them all what a great story yeah (laughs) no actually there was a guy on eBay and he had fucking heaps man like I don't know like heaps like it'd be a good 50 I'd say Mm. how much were they 150 buy it now and it was up for like about 10 seconds and I just bought it straight away and and I'm like when do you want me to come pick it up so I went round and yeah, it was just in a big bag. He used to collect them, but he had a baby and the missus telling him to get rid of them. So get rid of her. Yeah, 
That was an absolute bargain, man. Like, 50 characters for 150 bucks. Is that all your set, basic? Or the, all your collection, pretty much? The, Did you get uh, a couple here and there? Yeah. Because you got the faceless one separate, didn't you? Yeah, and I've got, like, He-Man's mum and King Randor. And I've got heaps here and there. Plundor and another merman who's a variant colour. Who came in the DC versus pack. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that was a ripper one to get. And, um, yeah, no, I bought a few and I bought Hordak and shit like that. But, yeah, no, nah, most of them I got. And I got, like, rare ones, apparently, that are rare, like Is I see that, on eBay. The, the toothless, um, the Skeletor, oh, the yeah. dentist one. Yeah, that's from the um, that's, Robot Chug yeah, episode. But, but that was from a convention or something. It was from, like, a, a Comic Con or something. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Which is pretty cool, and Keldor's rare, apparently. Yeah, and he's a ripper. That's a really cool toy. Yeah, I know, he looks fucking rad, doesn't he? And he's he's a, like a brighter blue than Skeletor. Yeah, and a tough gun, too. Yeah. He was tough as fuck. But yeah, look, I've bought a few here and there, maybe, what, ten or something, maybe, I'd say. Fucking ripper, it's a good collection. Yeah, it's pretty ripper. Get more one day. I always wait for the ultimate bargains that happen on eBay. Ah, oh, you've got to. And I'd buy shit. But yeah, they're like 50 bucks plus a figure, you know, so... Have they been going up or sitting steady? Oh, uh, depends. Like, some of them are real rare and shit. they got at the moment on eBay, which is a fucking bargain, is in that 2000X, mm. there's a Keldor. Oh, is there? Yeah. So. And it only came out at, like, a comic convention in America somewhere. Mm-hmm. That's the only way, way you could get it, yeah. And it's on eBay for a hundred bucks. Oh shit! That's a bargain. That's a lot of money. Yeah. Like a hundred bucks is a big fucking chunk of cash, but that is a good buy, you know. Like it's usually about a three hundred dollar figure, according to eBay, you know. Yeah. The, and what things are only worth what people will pay, so yeah. you know. So, but I'd happily pay a hundred for him. But yeah, it's not a bad figure, man. So there's also that He Man convention too. Which they probably in America, put out, yeah, put that shit for as well. Oh yeah, of course they would. Yeah, because they're convention exclusives. Yeah, which makes it fucking so hard to collect shit if you want to get a, like a full set, you know. Yeah, well, the so hard to find. But full set the matter. new stuff. But there's there's only so many of the originals to to collect. But yeah, let's have a have a fucking butcher's a disappearing act. Sounds ripper to me. Yeah, set it up on the tablet. Go set it up. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, that was comfy then. Yeah, I know. Here we I'm just going to have a sip of my iced coffee. All right. But, um, no He-Man figures since the last pod, I'm afraid to say. Haven't seen any out and about, which is a bummer, but always keep my eyes peeled, don't I, Eddie? That's all I... But it was ripper starting this, um pod and stuff and then I find that fucking Prince Adam just before we start it um what did I find in hard rubbish oh on fucking last Sunday go on let it out fucking Snake Mountain fucking just on the side of the road absolute fucking ripper find is it in better condition than mine is uh, is your microphone ripped off no it's connected oh wow has it got the inside bits and the has it, got it doesn't the have a battery cover Oh, doesn't it? On it, but it's it's got it looks like all the stuff's there. Is it nice and clean? It's pretty clean. Okay, you put it in the garage or something in the shed. We'll put it into the clagger. No, don't fit. But we'll um yeah. So if you guys are gonna watch along with the episode, it's it's on YouTube. Disappearing act. Well, that's what we typed. He man in the Masters of the Universe disappearing act. And as he comes up, there's two of them. One goes for 21 minutes, 35 seconds, and one goes for 19.32. But what's the top one on He-Man official? Yeah, of course, yeah. Because that other one's not official, and it's got more views. Yeah, how do anyone's watched that second one? And all that kind of stuff, so... So... Alright, so load up your thingy. If we go load... Start the thing, Gav, so we can load up. Oh, the... you want me to start it? That's the top one? Yeah. And then when the filmation goes, ting, then stop it. Ting. Yeah, so it's pause. Yeah. Filmation has just come up. Oh, no, it didn't stop. I paused it. You saw me pause yeah. it. Well, we'll start it again. 
That's right. Now start it. Ting, pause. Yeah. Yep, did it that so time. So Filmation Presents has come up. You guys should have had enough time to... Um, Do so. Set yours up. If you got if you got the time to sit there and listen to us, you got the time to fucking yeah. load up an episode. You got nothing to do. Disappearing act. Um, it's filmation's gone. Ting. The presents has just come up. It's yep. at two seconds on the counter, and so we're gonna count it in. Three, two, one, play. So three, two, one, play. Yeah, it's gone. And then he stopped it again. All right. So hey, man. man. Masters of Jizz Universe. Dun, dun, dun. That's it? a fucking ripper song. Yeah. Oh, when, with the theme song, they got Tails to do. Yeah, Tails is a ripper. I said, fucking do us a, a He Man. Uncle Tails. He Man theme, but do it like it's on a Casio keyboard, like the. <laughs> well, he came it, up with it. Yeah, like someone's playing it. And then he looked at it to see how to play it. Yeah. And it's really fucking complicated song. Like this, there's so much shit going on with this song. Really? Yeah. Like they fucking rocked it out. Like all these bits. Like this is the bit that I wanted because this is like the main thing. Yeah, this part is. Yeah, but all the other bits, like. Ready? Look, what's he gonna do? Gonna, oh, snaps the screen. Fuck. Blue Shimer. And get ready to read out the the writer and director too when that comes up. You read it out. No, you do it. I don't want to. I don't want to do it. But it's important for the cunts to get credit. They're all jerks, those guys. Mm, they made Ripper cut in, so... Hey, bloke. 1983. Oh, story by David Chap, teleplay by David Chap and Robbie London, and another one by directed by Lee Zukor. Mm, and we start off... Ooh. Look at all that stuff. <coughs> Hitting up Snake Mountain. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's Handsome Mountain. Love how the fucking... Doesn't look anything oh, yeah. like the toy, though. Nah. I wonder why they put that fucked up fraggle face on the toy. That looks so cool on the the toy snake mountain, though. Yeah, I know. Like, what are these guys talking about? Fucking Skeletor will be chin wagon saying, I'm going to fuck this shit up. The colours on Beastman's rad, too. That mm. orange red with the bright blue. But look at Skeletor. That fucking, <laughs> that's just the raddest villain ever. This looks just dope. I want to get like a full skeleton figure and then like get a... Oh, like a doctor's office skeleton. Yeah, thing. and then fucking put a skeletal costume on it and paint the fucking face yellow and shit. Who are these dickheads? I don't know. Look at this cunt. He looks dumb. Yeah, they look like idiots. Yeah. They well, sound quick. like fucking dummies too. Quick, quick, go. Oh, they got a souped up fucking wag fucking thing. Oh, you're going to cop have shit. You if you're trying to go around. You dumbasses. If that off. hits them and their car doesn't melt. They're cattle trucked, aren't they? Yeah. They're cattle trucked, <laughs> alright. What is it? Oh. oh fucking look at this guy. Look, the, he man's that fucking rad that he can fly straight through that shit and none of it touches him. And he can shoot. Look at that. Is he going to shoot the walls? Yeah, out? he's going to shoot dust on top, rocks on top. Watch. Fuck, he's... See? So is he just on patrol then? Just... Yeah, just... Having around? <laughs> yeah. Sussing the case. turnier out, yeah. Yeah, seeing if the fucking... In case there's some dumb cunts. Skeletor and his dickhead mates are fucking kicking up a ruckus. Yeah. Look oh, at look him. at him. Looks like he's fucking enjoying that. Yeah. They probably steer those things with their dicks, though, don't mm. they? Yeah. Maybe you probably have to plug it in. That's why Teela sits funny on it too. <laughs> Teela's always smiling too. See Skeletor's teeth are the same colour as his face. Well, so are yours. If you had your skull. Your teeth are made out of bones just like your skull is. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> Classic Gav. Shut up. Look, it's all right. look. Putting a fucking Harry on. Goodbye oh, Skeletor. Oh shit. It's invisible. So he's going to kidnap Adam mm. to lure out He-Man. He -Man. Little does he know, same cunt. But it's, it's the same bloke, Gav. Yeah, I know. We know oh, that. Oh, look at those, those cool other um, Orco people. Or Trollins, they'd be. Yeah. He's See from he's... Troller. Look at the cunt's bed. It's a big Orco hat. Oh, yeah. That's sick. And it's hands. The bed's a hand. Oh, it is too. 
I would love to make if I was like rich I'd make that bed remember on the Simpsons when Milhouse's dad is so I sleep in a race car do you yeah so I sleep in a bed with my wife yeah <laughs> And went home and made the bed for Bart when he was little, the clown bed. <laughs> oh, yeah, scary as fuck. Yeah, I'd love to make that bed. Anyway, Orko's going through the bag of tricks. And it's actually got tricks written on it. Yeah. Now look at his little, that little Necronomicon he's got with the fucking hands. The book stands are hands. Oh, yeah, it's cool, isn't it? It's got a fucking bin there. <laughs> look at that. Wow. It's just snapping through shit. Look at fucking Prince Adam. Loving the haircut. <laughs> Reckon if I got a haircut like that, I'd end up with a Sheila like Taylor. I reckon you'd end up with a bloke like Adam. Nah, fuck <laughs> that. I'm not that way inclined. No. I'm, I'll go oh, after shit. Taylor though. Oh, See, and, he's, and Adam's sword just happens to look exactly like the power sword too. Yeah, the, yeah. No one notices. For a bunch of cunts that fucking have flying vehicles and can disappear and do rad shit, they're fucking oh, shit. dumbasses. I know where it's gone. It's gone back in time. Yeah. <sighs> You're so clever. Because it's from that quiz. What's going on now? No, it was yeah, just they're a stressing, but she doesn't fucking... know. She's not smart enough to realise that it's the same sword as He Man's. And she's But fucking... they, these guys only know. Like, um. He only knows because Sorceress tells him. And Orko only knows because. He was... fucking. He, he, he. Like, caught him changing. Yeah, no, he caught him. No, he didn't catch him changing. He was hanging off him. He went to. He went to. Grey Skull as well. Oh, was he there? Yeah, he was fucking just hanging. And <laughs> look at that old dude. Yeah, it looks Ripper. Yeah. He's behind the curtain. Uh oh. Fucking that can't bum rush in your joint. Yeah. <laughs> That's a fucked up laugh. Yeah. There's no beavers and butthead. Yeah. Oh, watch <laughs> out, look. Oh, shit. Oh, he's freeze raised him. Yeah. And Orko, everyone's fucked now. Maybe your mate, man at arms, is going to step up. Oh, so he's your clever Ed. Yeah. He's got two hats. Yeah. That's dumb because now he doesn't know where Prince Adam is. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he'll follow Prince Adam. He just said where Prince Adam's going. No, but when he put the hat on, Adam disappeared so he didn't know where he was. Oh, okay, yeah. Fucking the stash on it. see? Dishing out advice. Like, yeah. he's annoying that cat no he's a dickhead look at fucking man at arms rocking a fucking ranger stash and that's fucking, not ranger it's brown but black fucking what black eyebrows that's alright look it's easier to draw look at the way she's sitting black. with her legs open that'd be a top view for fucking man at <laughs> arms do you minge has feathers on it too nah that'd be a nice she, she's very clean. It looks like her means would be pretty... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty nice and tidy. Yeah. yeah well he does have big black eyebrows. Yeah. Oh. Cringe is stuck and do shit. Yeah, not as cringery, like. Not without the the power sword. Well, they've got to go back and get it. Mm. Cringe has got a fat tummy, too. Mm. It just sits around and does fuck all. He's a, he's a fucking loser. No, he's real. Dole Baji, he's fucking shit. <laughs> he can't do anything till he's fucking Battle Cat. Either can fucking Prince Adam. Prince Adam can get kidnapped. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The guy, the voice actor, does a good, like, different voices. The yeah. Prince Adam sounds young and He Man sounds like a superhero. Yeah, and there goes Skeletor again. Prince Adam goes, on oh, what are you going to do if He Man lobs up and he's not going to do this? Always tells the cunts what he's going to do. No wonder he loses. Yeah, he is fucking... He's incompetent as fuck. Yeah. He's very powerful. Yeah. A real cunt. He's eh? up himself. Yeah. That's his problem. Must be an AFL player. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. Oh, there you go. 
So another man at arms invention. Watch. Oh, he's a fucking ripper inventor. Yeah. Oh, Stratos, yeah. Mm. Oh, shit, wolf bats. What are the wolf bats going to do? you got a laser cage around you. They can't get you. Who's this guy? It's a he-man. See? Does just he co- make in a fake or as well? Is no, it just, just a- coincidentally making a he-man. It just, did you hear him? He goes... Did he mention it earlier? Or? No. Just one of the side projects, I guess, and just mm. happens to starting to look like He-Man, so it's going to come in very handy. See, I love how... It's oh, shit, look at just, that artwork. Yeah, that's fucking rad. It's so busy, that would have taken so long to paint and draw. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Oh, look out, it's a bat. That's a bunny. Hmm. Swamp Hopper. Like a Johnny Hopper. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? I'm going to call them Swamp Hoppers now. Yeah, like Johnny that's Hoppers. <laughs> Comes a swamp. Oh, farins. I'd love so to fucking... Not funny. See that? It's, it's stares straight down the barrel fucking breaks the fourth hole. He's a shit cunt. I'd love to fucking... I like that. I'd, I, I hate the fucking cat worse than the man at arms now. Oh, I'd you your He's you. such a wanker. Look at his big, fat, stupid belly. <laughs> oh, look at that guy. Yeah. That's gross. That's like Org or something. Org. Grog. Gog or something. Has he... Did that hack go through earlier or is he just... Is Orko just sending shit back in time all the time? I don't know. Orko's fucking... You know what's wrong with this cartoon? It's like everyone except for about two people are really shit at their jobs. Yeah. So like He-Man and Teal are the only two people that can actually get shit done. Yeah. Everyone else is just a bunch of shit cunts. Not all of them. This guy needs look at him. I suppose yeah, Battle Cat him. as well, but... Oh. That nah, takes You know what? Well, Orko's Quick, just grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, and bump. Get it and bounce. No, if... If Orko grabbed the sword and held it aloft and said, "By the power of, by the podcast of Grey Skull," yeah, would he turn into yeah, the watch. man Orko? Oh no, he does do it in one episode. Fucking ripper! See, now with the the transformation, does it last for a while? Like when you like the Hulk, like it wears off? No, he has to go back and change back. Remember, we spoke about that last yeah. episode. But he does. He, he usually does it off camera though, doesn't he? he does it. Yeah, you never see it. But oh, look. So you could, um, theoretically, if he if you could get the sword off him like that. Yeah, anyone can use it. You could rock it by the power of Grace Guy have the power, turn into he Gav. Yeah. And then just fucking run shit. Yeah. You'd be the, like you could tell all those just be chasing you'd bitches. Go fucking kick he, like Skeletor off his snake throne yeah I, I wouldn't take any Skeletor shit and then run and then run shit cause... just chop the cunt's fucking legs off and shit <laughs> then he'll be back in about 10 years again and then I'll chop his arms off he'll come back in another 10 I'll just fuck him up <laughs> quick it's gonna go quick quick but then yeah you could just run fucking Eternia yeah. oh there's heaps of them oh. they look all gross and yeah. did the why did the cat go he didn't do anything he got the sword. Orko got it. The cat chased after it. Well, he retrieved it, but Orko could have done that. Oh, fake He-Man's coming. Oh, because Man at Arms knows that the sword needs to go back to Adam. Mm, so that He-Man can throw it at Adam. Yeah. But the fucking... The, the right is solid. Yeah, but he has to get out of the cage first. And make sure no one watches him. Well, Stratos is going to... Yeah, here comes Stratos. He'll fuck the bats up hardcore. Yeah, in the 2000X cartoon, he's got the Sean Connery accent. Yeah. The Stratos. Sounds heaps like him, doesn't it? Yeah. Fine blank at Warwick Farms. <laughs> Stratos is on the mission. Stratos is rad. Yeah. Look, found him. See, he's another guy that can do stuff. 
Yeah, the other cunts do shit, like these characters. That yeah. On the good side, they do shit, but the bad ones fuck shit up. See, Man at Arms is rocking it now that he doesn't have to fight. Yeah. He's, so he's good at setting shit up and using all his gadgets. Yeah, that he makes. Yeah. And they always seem to just be necessary when he's inventing them too. Yeah. Just coincidentally. Well, it works out. Oh, look at Beast Man. Fucking Black Eyes Hardcore. Skeletor's been eyes. snapping him. That's his markings. Yeah, I know. That's how he shows all the Beast ladies how tough he is. Mm. <laughs> What's this the ice attack track? Oh, it's schooning now. Mm. Look at it, it's a mystery machine. Hmm. <laughs> oh, so you're very clever. So Skeletor would have gotten away with it if it mm. wasn't for those pesky kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Skeletor coincidentally. Oh shit. Oh Fuck. Just dropped the tablet. That's alright, it's still going. Yeah. Silly thing. What's Prince Adam doing? Well, he's glad to see him. Fucking, watch this for a ripper throw. It's, oh. it's too far. You shit cunt. Fucking. Do you just run up and just give it a little fucking... Just eh. throw it properly. Oh, it went through the bar, so... Oh. You see, now that's just bravery. He's got something to prove. Oh, looks stretcher. like Mr. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh, you remember the um, Harlem Globetrotters cartoon? Yeah. And they had, there was a stretchy one and yeah. one had a basketball head. The and Hanna-Barbera cartoons. I think one had spring legs or something. Yeah, he one did. was a spring. <laughs> Why would you not like it? Yeah. You, have, you stop being a fucking useless piece of shit for ten minutes. Do a... Bold, fucking how good's that song? Yeah, that is fucking ripper. Look at Beat, look at Battle Cat. Fucking, it's ha- it has to be one of the best transformations. It's, it's so yeah. fucking noisy and there's so much rad shit going on. Yeah, watch him just snap it. Yeah, that, that happened in that other one. They thought yeah, they could chain him up. Oh, oh. just snap the wall. Fucking hell. That was the same as the start, but with a different background. Yeah, his face is drawn shit there. Yeah, they're after Skeletor. Oh. They fucked up attack track there. Mm. He's going to bust the the little shit robot and think he's tough. No, yeah, he's going to realise it's a robot. And then be spewing. So he's, he's so up himself, he thinks he man scared or something. Yeah, he just don't talk shit, he just oh. do it. Oh, that's gross. Mm. I love fucking Skeletor's staff. Yeah, the ram horn. Yeah. Ram skull. Oh, he's a real bloke. Oh. Oh, look, just blowing him away. He's got power, breath like um, Superman. Yeah. Grab that thing, someone. Oh. Oh, fucking, that was a left foot too. (coughs) Go on, okay, get him. Oh, I jizzed out of his head. No, oh, that's a fair yeah. load. That's heaps. Oh, he looks like a Kardashian. Oh. Oh. Uh-huh. And now what? They're not going to take him to... Well, they're taking him to the prison mine. No, they won't. They never do. We well, might get away at the end. Oh, oh shit. Right. The Skeletor's not stuff. fucking scared. No. He's not very good at fighting, but he's fucking... Got guts. He's a, he's a goer. Oh, he's oh, got his oh. invisible hat. It's gonna bounce. But they didn't. They coloured in his under his arm, in between his arms. Oh yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. It's good picking out mistakes. Oh, like snapping him. You know why they fuck up like that and do all those? Throw dirt on him, and you'll see him. Yeah, why? It's because they had to pump him out so fast they couldn't. Yeah. Go through and watch it again and say, "No, I'll take that bit out." They just it's fucking close enough, it's good enough, get it out. Yeah. Throw dust on him. Get, get Orko to jizzle over him and then you'll yeah. be able to see her. It'd be a big fucking... Oh, is Orko naked? Oh, there you are. Smash it. Oh. Fucking just breaks everything, doesn't he? Yep. Oh, Havoc stuff. That's fucking awesome, man. That's a rad name. Can I show What's you What's he going to do? Yeah, get him, cat. 
See, this cat's hair's better than the shit one. What's gonna happen? <laughs> What's he doing? <laughs> oh shit, wolf bats, they look cool. Yeah. How come did he put the the beeper on him? Must have. But well, he could just tell him to stop, couldn't yeah. he? Yeah. <laughs> Don't just fucking run away. Oh. There's no cookie in that tusk already. Put the beeper on him. Fuck. Fuck, he's clever. How did he get his clothes back on? It could have magic some more up, couldn't yeah. it? Yeah. But he's not smart enough, maybe. <laughs> That's weird how his scarf looks there. Yeah. Looks like intestines. Oh, look. Oh, that's cool. Get eggs. Look how fat um, Duncan's neck is. Yeah. Fuck it. Here we go. Oh, what's... So it's not being powerful. What is it? What's the lesson? His brain. Oh, what's more powerful than uh, muscles? His cock. He's fucking trans and trains. Yes. <laughs> like, oh, he said just like a muscle. <laughs> so I'm right. There you go. <sighs> Fuck, that was a good episode. Yeah, wasn't it? It took three people to write it, so that's why they fucking. It was two. two one guy got same. one guy got credited twice. Elephants, lions, Ed. Mm. Same. Well, I enjoyed that. That was a good one. Yeah. See, you make Duncan, he fucking turns it See, up. See, yeah, he fucking, I knew he'd come good. Yeah. Now yeah. it's that fucking shit cat that I don't like. Yeah, you're gonna rag on the poor cat. I'm go- yeah, every time he's a fucking shit fucker, he is a pussy. But, um, so that was Disappearing Act. You guys uh, listening at home, if you want to watch the next episode, it's She Demon of Phantos, which is actually episode five in the production order. We're gonna take a quick. Um, piss break and podcast of Grace God will be back after these quick messages if you're lucky and we're back we're back but you wouldn't have known how long we were but we were fucking ages man yeah it says we're a ripper yeah we just cruised along but we are back as promised and now we're watching She Demon of Thantos full episode yep and it's the we're watching the He-Man official one again which should be yep. the first on your thing if you're watching along at home on YouTube 21 minutes and 37 seconds so um let's get us started up so you guys should be able to type that in get it ready oh oh there's an advert and I, I don't like it when they put adverts on shit that's not theirs yeah I don't mind people sharing shit on like YouTube because it's oh Done it. Yes. Well done, Eddie. So get it loaded up. It's just done the filmation. Did a little ting. The presents has come up. It's at two seconds. Oh, look what's come up as the thing here. Hey, man, 50 things about it. I'm going to watch that when we're finished. Okay. Yeah, carry on. Um, Two seconds in as per usual. Uh, the cat's making noise, but... Yeah, that's how okay. the cat rolls. Uh, what are we doing? So we're going to on three, two, one, play... We're going to press play, so get ready. Yep. Three, ready. two, one, play. Get ready for yep. it. Here it Here comes. Here it goes. Oh, that song. Never gets tired, does it? It's so important to have a ripper song for your yeah. thing too, isn't it? Fuck yeah. This one's loud too. Yeah, fucking full screen it. Yeah, you got to full screen it. Turn the volume down a bit. Yeah, that's all right. Look at him. By the podcast of Grey Skull. That's yeah. a ripper name, isn't it? Yeah, it's fucking ripper. I'm yeah. so glad I Sorry we didn't it. use any of your guys' um, Did people su- say suggestions. stuff? Yeah. Did they? Someone said um, Skelecast. Oh, that's pretty sweet. That's a good one. That's better than Skeletalk, but... Yeah. That could be about Skellingtons. Same as Skeletalk as well. But, but um, a good uh, game fucking, nonetheless. Fucking Fuckface um, suggested R2's podcast, which... Really doesn't help anyone. Two's podcast. R2, because that's his new name. Oh, R2. fuck, he's a shit cunt. I'm still waiting for you, <laughs> cunt, to send me 
those Simpsons things. I've told Emmy and she keeps asking me. Oh, yeah, you just got put on blast. Yeah. All right, shut up. I do appreciate it. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, written by Ron Schultz and Sam Schultz. It's a Schultz affair. And it's directed by Gwen Butzler. Oh, Gwen. So this should be a ripper. This is a... Um, the other ones were, were mostly Sam, the Zuko guy. So it's a new director. Mm-hmm. Ripper artwork again. The background artwork is so turn, good. Yeah. That's a different place. So what are these guys doing? They're battling. They're practicing. That looks like he's, he's um, she becomes. Oh, that's a ripper yeah. gun. It's got a big knife on the bottom. But that's like the the toy. Yeah. Shield. Oh look. Oh, this looks familiar. Yeah, you've seen this. Trust me. <laughs> There, she's, she's fucking chilling back. Yeah. Just chilling in the cut with her homies. Yeah, piss off. What's up? She's on her rags. No, nah, she's fucking... She's fucking just smoked a big bowl and she's fucking... <laughs> she's fucking on the Murray, mate. She wants fucking man at arms just dust her to give it a mm. tickle. The, the, the faces are on model in this one, too. Mm-hmm. Did that fucking stiff animation for the walking? That's a, that's a. Oh. <gasps> what the fuck? They didn't wait long to reveal themselves. No, they're fucking hanging. They they fucking like He Man and and, and Bloke of Warwick's could have fucking heard the curtain fucking coming back and just yeah. say, oh, "What's that behind there?" Like, oh fuck it, there's Skeletor and all these goons. No, he's not going to do that. Elmora. Yeah. That's like fucking Samantha's mum from Bewitched. Yeah. Who's that guy with the spiky face? That's strong arm, I think. Yeah, Is he a real guy? Arm. Yeah. Look at both these. He didn't come out in the original figures, but he came out in the classics. Oh, good plug. Mm. Yeah, I thought nice. she was a mini, but she's fucking... She's, oh. she's putting up a fucking dip. Look at her. Yeah, she's going to cop her own shit now, nah. see? I wish she, she'd known that fucking Skeletor's hands were immune to her finger shots. Oh, look, he's made her old. Now she looks like the um, Samantha's mum from Bewitched. <laughs> oh, she's old as fuck now. That's voice acting. So this is Palace of Turn, yeah? Yeah. Oh, look at that fucking thing. Oh, they're fucking, um, the dodgy ones. Yeah, because Skeletor gave it. So, yeah, gave them the, the, the shit stuff. Oh, it's steel. Yeah, like, yeah steel is fucking tough as. <laughs> Good idea, Rocco. Okay. You'll go with him. See? See, in, in that case, I don't blame him for being pussies because there's fucking broken weapons flying at them. Yeah. Look, they're just. Races. Fucking shit up. Oh, here she comes, the sorceress. Should whisper louder. Yeah. Did that bird, the toy's name is Saw, isn't it? No. Pretty sure. What's it called then? It's got a name, it's not yeah. Falcon. No. That's cool, her fucking. I want her in the figures. I haven't got her. Yeah, she's such a good costume. Yeah. I didn't like in the um, in the two thousand series they made her all Egyptian. Yeah. And blue and yellow and stuff. Yeah. Because that's such a good design. It's one of the best designs in the whole like, Thing. show. Yeah. Yeah. Categories. Oh fuck yeah. It's time to Getting change. it done early in this one. Yeah, well, shit's been fucked up straight from the so, start. Oh, it's five minutes in, five and a half minutes in. So you look there, bang. Stupid cat. No, now he's a good and everything. cat. Rah. Imagine hitting Charles and Bruce with that. Oh, fuck it, yeah, then they wouldn't be useless. <laughs> hey, they're bargain foot hunting dogs, don't they? Yeah, that's it. true, they are good at that. Yeah. 
It's a cool hat. Yeah. I think that's black hair. Those Skeletor's are really strong design too. But yeah, he's Ripper. But that one's good too. Oh, look at it. Here we go. They're going to Fantos. Why not? Taylor's like dope, but she needs to guard everything, I guess. I'm pretty sure she's the captain of the guards. Uh, Maybe that's in the 2000X series. Maybe. I'll oh, leave her in a dust. Yeah, they like fucking... If I can stay here because the gun can invent flying things and freeze rays and disappearing rays. Oh, who's that little frog dude? That's um, that's that frogman guy, isn't it? Where is he? He's Stratos. There, who's that guy? Lizard. Is he a toy? Yeah, in the two thousand X years. Oh, I mean, in the uh, classics. classics yeah. Those classics are so rad. Is yeah. he in any other episodes or just this one? Um, it's just this I can think of. I could be wrong. If I could, I like Stratos too. Yeah. Well, Did she just tag along? Yeah. They say so shit they don't even notice. She'll get herself in trouble. Not yeah, listening she to was... the old man. <clears throat> or is that... She's the wrong way for a start. No, she meant to go through there. That was a, like a... That was Evelyn in disguise or something. Uh, I don't know what's going on. I like the little frog lizard, man. Yeah, he's dope, isn't he? Oh. See, she's not fucking... I don't know what's going on. See, we, we talk over it. We, we don't follow the plot, so... Oh. Look, she's all jacked up. Yeah. So he doesn't recognise it. She's got Elmora's dress and stuff on. Yeah, bit of white streaks in the hair. Could do with a good iron in the old boat race, but apart mm. from that, she's the same. Oh, oh Battle, Battle Cat can fucking have a dip. Oh, shit. Oh, look how bad his eyes looked. Hmm. Did they ever make an Elmira toy? Oh, in the classics, they would have. <laughs> Fucking, um, Stratos' face looks all stupid. Yeah. And that's from the toy, too. It's in the the mould of his faces. He's got that stupid face. Yeah. <laughs> See, he man will do the right thing. What's that tree doing? I don't know. Oh, shit. Still alive, shooting shit. That's got oh, lasers. Stratos has copped it. He man will fucking break out of that shit. See... Oh, it's like a Venus flytrap, but it's in Eternia, so it's got... It disappears, yeah. <coughs> it shoots lasers and then disappears, yeah. Is that, is that really Tila? Does she have a, a transportator? It is her. You reckon? Hmm. Or is she the she-devil? Hmm. Oh, that face. Mm. Was that a bad drawing, or was that to... Show that she's a bad guy in disguise. Because they do that shit all the time. Yeah. It's hard to tell. But it will, it'll reveal itself. Did, like stuff like this when they they just add like a new character every episode and shit. Do they ever come back or? Sometimes, yeah. What are these guys doing? Carrying shit on a conveyor belt. Look like jerks. I'll put these two. Yeah, they made these. Are they going to be trouble? Or whatever. Slave drivers. Slave <laughs> Look at that cool costume. <laughs> that little lizard guy, he hasn't done anything, but he's fucking rad. Yeah, he's just cruising along. Look how big that guy's arm is. Did you see? Yeah. Almost as big as mine. Have you got one massive arm and one normal size one? Yeah, from having oh, half man, packs. Man. Too many half packs, eh? Yeah. Well, Is there guys in inside there. these little no, sarcophaguses? Not just guys are in there. Ah, that's yeah. lucky. <laughs> oh, they're body cells. Ooh. Yeah, snap him. He's a fucking jerk. Merman's got a fucking big fat neck. Ooh. They might man an arms did something. 
Yeah, it's, well, it's been in Australia. It's got a boomerang with handcuffs on it. Oh, that's a ripper. Oh, they're not going to fucking do that to him, man. Oh, his shirt busts off because his muscles are so big. Yeah. See, man at arms can fucking rock it out. Look, strong arm. Oh. Snap him. Kapush. He's gone into that cell. What's going on now? We're stuck in there. What more do you need to know? Yeah. See, that thing there looks like a big leg with a foot on it. Yeah, it does to the shoe. Oh, that looks oh. like a, a tarot of grace gold. <laughs> what? That's a... That's a shitty design. Is that a man's voice? Probably. The voice actor? Yeah. Look how dumb his ears are, too. He's got big, stupid... Mm cauliflower ears I don't like this guy now I thought he was cool lizard guy's still fucking rocking it yeah hasn't done anything yet I think why I do like him is because he hasn't fucked up yet. yeah <laughs> <laughs> very fucking uh the yeah we'll oh, see so hey man's locked away oh look well, he's got a cool voice too Sounds like Corker. See, he's, he's offering up good fucking suggestions. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that shit can't hold hey man. No, the only guy who could get out of one of them. <laughs> man. Lizard man, he's mm. fucking best. He should have a better name though, like Steve or something. <laughs> Steve. Yeah. Steve Steve. the Lizard Man or this is Lizard Man but we call him Chuck (laughs) or or they say like hey they've got Teela Lizard Man and Lizard Man goes yeah yeah just just call me Barry (laughs) my mates call me my mates call me Barry look how fucked up her eyes Elmora should have just strengthened the thing because she's going to fuck him up now it's the moral of this story don't be a lazy cunt I don't know where well, everyone's been doing shit in this one mm. oh, what's look. this about Ooh. oh they're fucking floating mm. this one's to see he's yeah. fucking rips he's showing how big his muscles are Oh, suck it. Go on. Well, he's not being strong on. See, look at that shit. Oh, she's fighting out of her hands, Gav. Oh, she's crook. <laughs> Fair dinkum. I think he's got an upside down heart for a schnozzer. Yeah, he does. <clears throat> no. You're in oh, a nice video. He leaves the staff behind. The Havoc staff? Yeah. Doesn't eat him. She could save herself. Watch. Watch him and bum rush in now. Uh, what's she doing? Oh, look at your staff skeleton. Uh, you fucked up again. Uh, <laughs> she's telling him. So you reckon what? What is it that you like about Skeletor? He, he looks rad. Yeah. And he's a he's a fucking Can. he's yeah he's mean. He's not very good at anything. No, but he's a dope villain. Look oh, at him. that looks sick. He just wants the easy way out, mate. You know, doesn't want to fuck around and work on shit. But wouldn't yeah? That's but like Megatron is a good villain. He's not as mean, mm. but he just wants everyone to do what he says. Yeah. But his plans would work most of the time if it wasn't for Starscream fucking him up. Oh, they should fire his ass. But he's tried to. He kills him in the movie. Well, Galvatron does. Very nice. They should have shown him kicking those big fat cunt yeah, asses. Yeah, fuck they're, yeah. They were jerks. They're slave drivers. Huh. 
that guy's shit. Strong arm. You know why they didn't make a toy of him? Because he looks shit. Because yeah, because he's fucking an idiot. Uh oh. There's a big booby shot of the. What's going on here? She's going to turn into Skeletor. He is. Well, she's going to look at him and think of Skeletor. Smash the door. Oh, I just opened it. <clears throat> he usually just breaks everything. Mm. It's because he's so muscles. Plus. Thinks he's just opening a door, but it normally fucking breaks. Always put his mm. put a spell on her. Fucking sure has. Told you. Fuck, she's yeah. Yeah, what? Oh, put your hand out to block it like Skeletor. Did. Yeah. Oh, she's got a fucking. But it should sword be shit shield. stuff. It should be the good stuff because yeah. it's. It's at the place where they made it. Oh. Oh. What's going on? Relations. Oh, her shield changed colour. Oh, look out. Yeah, look, that's just full they... tripping. Because normally to break the spell... That Skeletor's made it. It's usually from a device. Yeah. And then the He Man just breaks it and the spell stops. But not that time. He used the staff. What's. Did he use his Havoc, havoc staff? Mm. Oh, which one is it? Nah. Mm mm. Oh, that looks cool with the eyeballs and the, yeah. the Skeletor eyes. See, and it fits the face. Yeah. Like the hair to the hood and shit. Oh, maybe Skeletor is like He Man's uncle or something. I think he is. Oh, or like yeah, uncle. It's like man and uncle, like um, fucking King Randall's brother or something. Yeah, which would make him his uncle. Mm. Wouldn't that be cool if that mm. was a thing? No, it is Look at Lizard thing. Man just fucking chilling. I know they all the evil um, warriors are just standing around. Mm. Look how many tummy muscles he man's got. Mm. The skeleton is just as ripped. It's just the way that George get, had like fucking 18 six pack muscles. Oh, cool. When he gets out, he man. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're mm. fucked. Oh, he's... What's he gonna do? They should just keep him in the uh, chains she, anyway. Yeah. There'll be no more ruckus. Now chuck him in one of those... Yeah. Photon... See, look. Tombs. Let's him go. Uh, yeah, and he's just back. fucking laughing at you for being softies. What did you think was gonna yeah, happen? Well, you leave him in it. We'll chop the head off the stuff. Oh, and, and they just let those... those oh, he always fucking... leaves the cunts behind. Look at Lizard Man did not one thing. <laughs> he spoke once. He spoke, he had, yeah, he had one line. And he's the best character in the whole episode. <laughs> <laughs> he's fucking awesome. Yeah, you love him. He should be the, the mascot of the podcast. Yeah, he could be. We'd have to buy the figure too. Is there one? Yeah, in the classics. In the there classics. Is. It's like 50 bucks. Is it? Yeah, it's a lot of money. might have a look after the podcast. Mm, it's a lot of money. But he's dope. Mm. Yeah. Well, she butter and bread. No, she's peeling a potato. Oh. Everyone's being punished because... They're on KP. Yeah, because Prince Adam fucking ran off oh. and got to sleep. Everyone's having oh, a Oh, she's just going to fucking beam him in the head with a potato. What's the story? I mean, the, the, the moral. About Safety. safety. Oh, it's beach safety. Swim between the flags. Yeah. Oh, crossing, crossing guards. Crossing guards. Yeah. Lifeguards, crossing guards. What happens? There's not always someone there to protect yeah, you. Yeah, you've got to... Practice thinking of safety all the time. Don't take a chance. 
Yeah. So they take risks. Think about like safety. That. Like I always say, safety first, second, and third. Yeah. Like that guy, you know, from Bargain Squad. Bargains. Oh, yeah. He says that too. That fucking um, Bargain Squad guy. Yeah, he, he you know... It's not you or anything. Yeah, but... fucking five beers earlier, I would have been able to remember his name. <laughs> <laughs> Tad. Tad, Tad Nubbins. Yeah. That's it. Fucking hey, man, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> so that was it. it. Yeah, that was it. That was Ripper. That was, what was she, Demon of Phantos? Yes. So fucking, um... That was Ripper. That was episode two of the He-Mans. Podcast... Of Grayskull. Yeah, that's what it's called. And so, we'll leave you on that. Where? As we fade out Ooh, that's, into Eternia. That's fancy. And um, we'll see you next time. Peace out. Thanks for listening. And we'll watch some more episodes and shit and do some dumb stuff and talk about He-Mans. Because that's what we're based at. Yeah. Peace. All right, we got to go. Bye.